Hello there and welcome back to another episode in Stranded Alien Dawn. So, in the previous one, we constructed this lovely little wind park over here. Some of them were moved over between episodes, so we had a few solar panels and wind turbines right in front of our house. So now it's nice and nice and empty. So yeah, we are pretty much ready to start uh, building up this zone over here. Okay, first things first, we do need some more... We might need some more carbon nanotubes and for that... Let's have a look. Nova, perhaps you jump in this one. Ember, mm, maybe in the slightly... Well, actually, the, I don't think we need both of you. No, yeah, let's undraft you. Let's only send Nova out. And Nova, you are going to go all the way... I think over here will be fine. Yeah, and then we can just clean out uh, that nest over there. And the second one in here as well. Okay. Cool. How far are you now? You're over there. I must know us busy moving to dig over those nests. I think with the ball fences. We can deconstruct everything in here as well. And most likely going up that way too. Okay, lovely. Did we miss one? I think we did. Oh, we scavenged one mechor. Again, you're an absolute legend. But it would be good if you brought it home as well. Okay, there we go. Nova has almost reached the mark. And are you able to know? Okay, gonna have to go a little bit further. I don't want to use the barrage over here because I'm afraid we might destroy something we're not supposed to destroy. So let's take it nice and easy. Or slow. Okay. Yep, there isn't too many scorpions defending over here. And I think that's done. Wait, it says one. Oh yeah, there is one more over there. Okay, lovely. Let's uh, get rid of you as well. And there we go. Yet another nest ready for exploitation. Okay, so one more over here. Nova has reached the mark and off you go. Okay, that should be pretty pretty quick and easy. Five, four, three, two, and one. Well, there is one more over there. Okay, lovely. Get rid of the nest as well. And let's just do a quick scan. I want to make sure it's all done before we send our troops over here. Okay, everything is done indeed, so Nova. Head back to base. Uh, maybe you park just over there. Lovely. Okay, this fence is starting to go down as well. So that is all good. Now what we... Uh, I guess we are going to have to remove... Oh no. Wait a second. You guys are... Oh, you're at the back of our village. Well, Nova's already home. She's pretty hungry, however. Yeah, we might do a quick switch of the teams. Queen, you're resting. Ember, you seem pretty okay. So why don't you jump into that one. And Ken, you seem quite... Uh, we might actually do Emeline instead. Yeah, because we don't have a... Oh no, never mind. We do have some cooking chops to do, so off you go, Ken. Jump into this one. If you go, let's advance a little bit right over there. And now the large mech as well. Okay, how many of you again? 18 scissor hands, scarabay, 150. Oh wow, that's quite a quite a few. Uh, Ember, we are gonna move you into defensive positions over there. So this is gonna be fun. Oh wow, here they come. Oh, that's a lot of them. Okay. Yep, they are getting awfully close to us. Maybe we try and move out of the way just a little bit. And you shoot this one as well. Alright, come on guys. I think we took a few good hits in here, didn't we? Yeah. Okay, and there's still loads of them coming. Right. Still another hundred left. Where are you guys? Okay, so you're all approaching us from there. Is that a good timing? He seems okay. Oh, wow. Okay, I think we're getting a little overwhelmed over here. Jump a little further away. Hundred and twenty-five. Okay, that is that is not good. Maybe we should have leaped to to safety. Okay, well that's actually pretty good to see. That means um, we overestimated the power of two mechs and the uh, 
thousands of bugs we had here. Oh, wait a second. There's only one left. Okay, here we go. This one we are going to park you over here. And that one over there. Yeah, so that's good to see. It seems... um, What was it? 200? 200 bugs. And the light mech has lost 400 health. And the combat mech as well. 300 health that we've lost over here. So with the bigger waves, we are probably going to need another mech. What we could also do is, if the bugs spawn a little bit further away from us, or, well, close enough, maybe we can send the missiles within from within the walls, distract them, or actually at get them to target us and then hopefully funnel them into our defenses over here but okay let's uh let's see how that goes anyways for uh, for now what we do want to do here is grab these fortifications and that fence uh, i think we are going to start constructing oh no we're not going to start constructing it directly from here is it right we still need this area over here housing let's take the floors we'll do something cheap so wood is fine i'm pretty sure we do want to have like a little platform over here a few fences maybe up until this way okay now the fortifications again and we shall drag you i think that is the spot isn't it yep okay how much carbon is that gonna take Bring back the UI quickly as well. Okay, so celebration at 7 o'clock. Uh, lost some food. Malfunctioned solar panel. Okay, so that should be fine. Yep, we've uh, moved the hot air balloons out of the way as well. Just so we have a bit more space to build everything we need over there. And let's have a look. Are you guys covered? Not really. But we can do another one. Here we seem to be fine. Same over there. So it's looking looking all good. And here we go. Walls are starting to go up pretty nicely over here. Toxic Ash has just arrived as well. But that's not going to stop our survivors from improving the defensive perimeter over here. And with, with the zone over here. I think you probably guessed it right. So that's exactly where we do want to have. A couple of flame, flame turrets. I don't think we need it this much further. I believe this might be fine in here. Let's have a look if we can do that should probably be enough and then if we want to add another one in the future we can probably do one more over here okay so that's lovely and we will connect it up like so as well yeah want to make sure that the bugs don't go into into this zone over here all right lovely now around this zone we do want to let's see how many carbon nanotubes we have left okay thousand that only took 500 which is not bad at all uh, right 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 flooring where is it carbon now that's the section that's going to be a little bit more expensive depending on how high do we want it okay i guess we could do it with six if it was only our people standing on it i believe they can shoot over or do we want it a little bit higher well that's the question Anyways, whilst we are figuring that out, I think we can also make sure that everything or nothing is touching the walls. And I think that's uh, pretty much done now. Alright, over here we do want to have those turrets shoot both ways. Well, this one here might be carbon eventually as well. For the time being, let's just make it bricks. Yeah, I think that's going to be fine for now. That's where we do want to place you kind of want to have it closer to the turrets what's going on over here how come you don't want to allow us to oh i see okay well we can move a few things around as well anyways let's start making some floors yeah floors there we go and um oh it's a little bit higher on this end let's uh let's just do it this way and then if we have to change it over we shall do it in the in the future all right lovely same all the way here now the question is do we want to continue it all the way here i think we do so let's do that as well how many tubes are you gonna take now there's 200 already in here so i think we'll be fine seems like we do have enough oh yeah last but not least we do want to connect the rest of you up as well. 
Okay, lovely. Right now, they can technically still pass through here without being hit by the flamethrowers. That's something we're definitely gonna fix up, maybe even today. We probably do wanna have like a separate circuit over here for turrets and something I've been dying to try out is this searchlight over here. Yeah, if we could have a couple. I don't know, maybe one towards the front, one over here. And let's have a look. When it comes to the defenses and circuits, I do have a strong feeling that motion sensors are the way to go about it. Yeah, perhaps. Okay, when it comes to the turrets, we will most likely steal a couple from the back over there. So lasers have the biggest range. And what we do want to defend is the relay station here. So I feel like we don't need the lasers right there. We might do one on the corner actually. And then turrets, couple over here, maybe like three, another laser on the corner, same on this side. Yeah, this could work. And this way, I guess in the future, we could even change this up and get rid of them as well. If this um, entry point proves to be a bit more useful. But we won't know until we test it out properly. Okay, it seems we have been building for quite some time. It is uh, end of another year, which means we are about to enter year four. Alright, oh, I've just noticed that um, there's 48 days in a year. Okay, well that's good to know. That means we should get this harvest about twice a year, if everything goes well, of course. And let's have a look. I did build a, another extension over here as well, because we're just not getting enough synthetic textiles from that one. And to be honest, this one, uh, 300 isn't a lot either, so we could also further increase this field over here okay lovely now this section is pretty much complete over here few changes i do want to have is let's turn this into a carbon floor and same with you guys carbon fence will be the one we aim for it seems we have mined out most of the nest already because our stockpile is 1.3 thousand now well yeah most of it i think is on the floor over here but that's fine our people will go over once they have a bit of extra time. Oh, interesting. You're just harvesting them through the fence. Okay, well, that's good, I guess. Right, another thing I do want to do here is a bit of a fail save. Okay, and what I mean by that is, let's say if there's a massive horde of bugs, 300 of them, and they're all gushing through this um, kill zone over here, I do want to have like a second layer that only kicks in once we are struggling. So I think, let's say, if we put the mo motion sensor about here, it should be fine. So you're going to be over there. And if any bugs get through this uh, walkway over here, then what's going to happen is we'll build like a tiny little floor here. Uh, not the tiniest. I think this will be fine. Yep, let's do it this way. And on top of here, we are going to have... I guess we can do like a laser in the middle. Let's have a look. You have a pretty massive range. So yeah, let's do this one here. And... Oh, you guys cannot be placed together. Well, that's a bit of a shame. So, okay, fine. We are not going to construct the laser. Oh, what is this? Oh, wait a second. We've got fireworks. Uh, oh, yeah, we still have them. Almost thought I completely missed them. What a way to start a new year, Emelyn. Sick already. And here we go. Talking about those bugs. We've got another raid on our hands. I hope some of you are not too tired because we are going to need your help. Okay, Ken, you are pretty exhausted. Lara, you seem to be fine, so why don't you jump into that smaller mech? Emelyn? Oh, you are already in here, which is lovely. Well, here we go. Let's, um... I guess we can pop the first one right over there. Okay, happy days. Lara, you're gonna have to advance a little bit as well. Shame we don't have those turrets online right now, but uh, I, I think we'll be fine. Yeah, most of them are retreating anyway, so... Well, Lara, you're not very helpful, so why don't you go a little bit further? Maybe... Hang on a second. Okay, no, no, stay over here. 
and start shooting this one. There we go. Okay, let's launch another one, I guess, over there, and let's have a look as well. Oh, wow. Okay, that's that's a lot of damage over there. And maybe you can advance a little bit as well. Just start picking them off from, from the distance already. Okay, now you guys are a little bit scared of us, it seems. Okay, we can do one more. Uh, where's most of them? I, I guess here we'll be fine. Okay, here we go. Okay, that's some pretty pretty lovely work. Only four left. I'm sure we can empty or clear up this base in no time. Yep, that's it. Here we go. Emlyn, you can go back. You guys finally attacking us now. Yep, where's the last one? And the wave is now complete. Lovely. Why don't you come back as well? Jump off. Get back to work. You might actually want to get some rest first it's been a long night i mean the guys and girls were drinking last night and then uh, straight back to work and now it's already daytime so i totally understand if you need to take a bit of a break before uh, carrying on with the rest of the work all right so ember is still mining that's lovely the wall is complete and um right i think it is the time where we can start what's going on over here oh right okay we're gonna remove this field and don't worry we'll place it back later but i just want to make sure we get this right so most of the turrets and defenses are going to be closer to us okay we still have one two three spaces over here which means we can do another layer of walls maybe some poles here and walkway i think this is a good place to start building it we may just pause it if we are starting to run low on some resources but before we complete it and turn it on we do need to get this power up and running as well yeah it's it's not the best i'll be honest and right now all this space is almost taken i mean the initial plan was that we we're gonna have food in here but if we are gonna do the same defenses on the other side then that means we're just gonna lose some more more space for our food items right what else can we do same in here a little bit of space i guess we can do some solar panels and wind turbines over here yeah we should be able to okay so another mission for us maybe we might even find a survivor i mean so far we haven't been very lucky in in the first four years but who knows when why don't you go check this one out it's only eight hours away so yeah, let's take a look. What's happening right now is that we've started putting in some electronics in here and I hope you, oh, you have used all of them already. Well, that's a bit of a shame. I was hoping we'll leave some in the stock in case something breaks down, but oh well, it is what it is. With the backup sort of defensive formation over here, laser in the middle, and it's a bit sad they can't be right next to each other, but it makes sense. They need a bit of space to maneuver around as well so this is how we are gonna do it i have a feeling this one mm -hmm, we might want to have it a little bit higher and the reason for that is i'm not sure if it's gonna be able to shoot through well why don't we leave you as it is and once these turrets are built we'll find out okay here we go malfunctioned 3d printer and you're gonna need electronics which we don't have oh no Okay, Ken. No, I think we want you craft electronics. We want until five. And that should probably be at the top in case we make a mistake like this again. Nope, there we go. All right, so expedition complete. All right, just some charred bodies. Well, that's a bit of a shame. Would have been cool to get another survivor in our colony. Nova, you're constructing Ember. You've gone to get some food. Why don't we see how much progress have you guys made over here? Okay, most of it is down. Oh yeah, tons of carbon nanotubes there as well. So that's lovely to see. Okay, cool. So food supplies seem to be going... Mm, they're not going up, is it? I think we had like 40 before, but... I guess it's okay, we have had to pull Ember, not Ember, Emeline out a few times. It is pretty late to go mining, are you sure about it? 
Okay, fine. Well, yeah, I guess you are well rested, so that is okay. And let's take a quick look at this progress over here. And we've got everything except cement already in here. Yeah, just 70 is what we need. 40 has been produced, so it shouldn't take too long. Electronics is just the last one that we do need, but... Yeah, we're not producing right now because that's offline. Okay, so for the time being, we'll pause the construction of the Ansible Relay over here. And uh, same with our defensive sort of turrets and the lights and everything else that we do want to have around this area. Uh, reinforce the, the, the zone that we, uh, we're constructing over here. And uh, once we have enough resources, especially electronics, we can continue the construction of all, all of those items here. Plus, we do want to expand our little power brick as well. I, I think this can be expanded a little further. Yep, all those blade grass fields can go out and we'll do some turbines and solar panels right over here. And if it doesn't suit us, then we can always move them around. But right now, it seems we do have an aggressive animal another wave over here but yeah why don't we take care of this one in the next episode so do let me know if you guys have some more ideas how shall we proceed with the construction of this base and uh, I'm very excited to see your comments so thanks a lot for all the love you've been sharing so far absolutely love reading all those comments so once again hope you've enjoyed this episode as well and we'll see you in the next episode